So we do a back retrieve now. So remember, she must be fully facing you. Whichever hand you're gonna use, you wanna take a step to that right. She's slightly leaning that way, so I'm actually gonna use the other hand. So the lead needs to go into my right hand. Look, and I'll push her out to the side. Good girl, good girl, yeah, good girl. Good girl, good girl. I'm gonna push her into a sit position, sit. She's a bit lively, good girl. Good girl, left hand lead, right hand retrieve, dead. Dead, dead. Ah, ah, good girl. Heel, sit, back retrieve again, we'll do it on the other side. Sit, heel. So she's not straight, so I wanna straighten her up. Sit, good girl. So again, straight line, dummy, dog, me. And then I take the step to either the left or the right hand side, depending on which side I want to set on. So I'm going to use my right hand this time. So a stop whistle has to come before that though. So, good girl, good girl, here, good girl, good girl, here, here, good girl, good girl, good girl, good girl, good girl, good girl, here, 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 sit, good girl, good girl, good girl. Dead. Out. So we're going to do that back retrieve with a recall sit this time. So heel, good girl. Heel. So the recall sit is towards you, and that's a pip 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 sound. So so when you do your recall sit, you always want to lean over as soon as you start to do your recall. Good. This is where the garden gets to its limit. Good girl, good girl. That's better. Round here, come on. Here, good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Sit. Good. She's a good holder, so she's really good to push into a sat position. This is something I do gradually over time, though, because I don't want to kill the fun of the retrieve. Okay, C shape with your hand. Push your gum in against the tooth, then it's really easy to take the retrieve. Right, left hand lead, right hand retrieve. So we'll do that again. I forgot to put the whistle in my mouth, that's not very good. Okay, retrieve down, turn it into her. Sit, good girl. Now, I'm limited in the garden here, but the more space you've got, the further you can obviously travel back. So sometimes I'll do a short recall sit, sometimes I'll do a long one. So you've got short, for example, there, and I'll over-exaggerate. So she was trying to dictate again then. I'm gonna come around. Now I'm not straight for that retrieve now, but I was just trying to show you how I'll alter and play around with the distance to keep the dog guessing and not trying to predict. She's constantly trying to predict what she thinks she wants, what she thinks you're gonna do and what she might wanna do. Hence all these little movements left and right. Good girl, good girl, good girl, yeah, good girl. Well done, well done, good girl. Sit, good girl. She's really good at holding a retrieve when you push into a sat position. A lot of dogs dead. A lot of dogs will automatically um, spit the retrieve out when you force them to sit. But she's very, very tolerant of it. Right, heel. Let's do... Slightly trickier retrieve now. So we're gonna put one behind her, like that. See, again, she's tried to move. So we now need to straighten her up. Good girl. We've got another dummy here, which is going to go out to the right. I'm going to bounce that off the fence. I always like to send them when I'm doing multiple retrieves, the dummy that I threw first, not last. So I'm going to send her for the back one. Look, good girl. You have to watch it. She doesn't try and go for that one on the way back, which is really, really typical. Good girl. So I'm going to take that off her. So I'm going to bring her back round and I want her to level her up with that one there. Sit, good girl. So I'm now gonna push this one down the right hand side like a bowling ball. Now she's probably gonna move when I do this. See, <laughs> it's really typical. Even my Springer still does this now and he's had 10 months of training, he still moves on it. So we're gonna pick that one this time. That's the idea. Good girl, good girl, good girl. You're a bit unsure about that one, aren't you? Come on, good girl, that's a smaller one. Yeah, it is, it's a small one. Sit, good girl, good girl. Left hand lead, right hand retrieve, dead. So we can line her up with this one now again. So we're gonna sit her up, sit, and bounce that one off the fence. Now, obviously she's, that's the last one she's seen down, so it makes that one harder, but I'm sure she'll do it. Split, good girl, 
Good gal. Good gal. Good gal. Good gal. Sit. Sit. So eventually, take that off her. I haven't done this with her yet. I might try in a second is where, as soon as you've sent her, go into a recall sit and see if you can then sit the dog up. I don't do this often until I've done this for quite a long time because it can make them reject the retrieve here, yeah, but we'll have a go. Sit. Okay. I'm gonna hit that one again. Split. Good girl, well done dead well that couldn't have gone any better for the first time i've never done that with her before so that's the beginning of a neat delivery we'll try it on this one as well sit and obviously you can do this the other way around so you, this is a, right, a back with the left and you can do a back with the right also she's getting hot now so not much more good girl come on she's a bit unsure about this retrieve because she's not picked this one before good girl Let's try it one more time on the back one. One more retrieve out of you. So I'll try the recall sit ending. Split. Good girl. See, she just let go of that very softly at the end there. Very, very softly at the end there. I'm pretty pleased with that though. I don't normally teach a dog to sit up and six, eight, 10 months old normally, like as in six or eight months of training before I do that because I don't want to kill the end. The end part is the fun part when the rest of it's quite pressured. So if you're too formal for the whole of the drill, it can knock the drive out of it, although she's pretty keen. She's a bit hot now though. But yeah, that was a back with the left. You can also do a back with the right. You can do lefts and rights on their own. And she can do a lot more distance than this, but obviously the garden's a limited space. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. Good girl. Here's your good girl. Come on in.